guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be doing a haul that I just recently did. This is kind of just a haul from a couple different places that I wanted to share with you guys. Some things that are definitely in stores now. So if you are interested, you know, you can go pick those up. So that way it's not something that's like a couple months later or a couple weeks later. This is very recent so that way I can show you guys. I recently went to a couple of places for shopping because I'm on the hunt to find a dress for a wedding as well as my niece, well I call her my niece, but um, she is getting dedicated at church. So I wanted a couple of outfits, you know, for some special things that are going on. I couldn't find an outfit, of course, for those events, but I definitely found some good fall staple outfits because I like to pick up a couple of pieces for fall or each season so that way I can just freshen up my wardrobe with those couple of things. Like I won't buy anything probably else for the rest of this fall season um, and I will just use those and abuse those until the next season comes around. Okay, so I did put everything in one bag just because I got it from multiple stores and I just thought it'd be easier just to keep it all in one bag for you guys. So this is the bag I have. I'm just going to start with the first place that I have like this stuff from and it is workout active wear just because I have been being a little bit more active and I have been going to the gym more often. So I wanted to get a couple more sports bras. Since we recently went to Orlando, we went to like the outlet malls over there and I wanted to pick up a few sports bras because they were really on sale. They were 20 bucks and they're usually like 40 bucks for Nike. So I wanted to pick up a few because I have been working out about four times to five times a week and I like to use a different sports bra of course. So instead of having to wash them all the time, I wanted to have one for each day. So that way I wasn't in a stinky one or like a sweaty one, you know what I mean? And I thought these were really cute. This one has a little bit of deodorant, but this is not mine. This, it's just somebody else's. I figured I would pick it up anyways, um, just because I loved this one. This was the only black one that they had there. It was my size. It has a little bit of mesh paneling back here, and it's a racer back. I just thought that was super cute. And I like sports bras that have a little bit of padding in them. Um, not so much, but just so that way your nipples don't show. Like, I don't want to be able to people to see me at the gym with like my nipples through my shirt. Um, that's like kind of a big deal for me. So I didn't pick up a couple others just for that reason. I love the colors. I love them. Um, I just did not like that fact about it. So, and I kind of wear shirts sometimes that you can see that. So I didn't want to pick up those for that reason alone. So I like this one. It just has the Nike check right here. It says high support. And I do like high support sometimes when I'm very active and doing a lot of cardio or just like CrossFit type of workouts. So this would be the sports bra I would pick for that day. It's always good to have a black one because it goes with everything. And the next one is seriously my favorite. It is so pretty. It is a blue one and it has this like mesh paneling right here. Literally like just something that you would see in a dress and then in the back it's a racer and it also has the mesh paneling. I've seen some really cute workout um, outfits that people will put like high-waisted workout um, yoga pants and then they will wear cute sports bras so that way it's only like a little bit of their midriff showing and it looks so freaking chic. So I wanted to pick this up for that reason because I want to go to Forever 21 maybe sometime in the future and pick up some high-waisted pants and pair those together. I think it would be so freaking cute because um, I think if you are feeling cute when you're working out, you feel inspired, you want to keep working out, you want to motivate yourself because you feel good, you look good, and I just feel like that's a big factor in it. So I like this one. It's not as high a support as the other one, but this would be more for like lighter days at the gym, you know, um, and it does have that padding in there. I like these because these are the Nike Pro ones, and the good thing about the Pro ones is they last a lot longer than I think the other ones. Um, I know Luster Lux said she preferred these so much better, and even the padding inside doesn't come out when you wash them, and they're not all over the place. So I wanted to pick that up for that reason, and this was also $20 as well, and it's normally $40. So half off, I thought that was a really good price. Okay, so the next thing that I purchased was just something really small from Marshalls. We went there to pick up an, a couple outfits for a birthday party we didn't get to attend, but we did want to get them something because they are coming over to our house for dinner soon. So while I was there, I saw this gorgeous, gorgeous bra and panty set. Um, this is the panties. They're just this blush pink color. They're just like 
boyfriend but they're lacy um they were like six dollars it came with a black one as well i never even thought to check in the like bra and panty section in marshall's to be honest with you i just didn't even think they had anything that interests me i always saw like older lady like nightgowns that just didn't look cute so i just never even went over there but they had these and the matching bra set which is by sophie b and it is this same matching blush color and it is so pretty it's lace it looks like something from victoria's secret you guys like it really gave me a push-up too because i barely have any boobs so i mean this really did a good job at pushing up my boobs and not feeling like too much padding sometimes i just don't like that and it's sheer on the side and it was 6.99 guys 6.99 and the same thing for these, they were $6.99, but it came with a black pair, which is nice because black goes with everything, and I like having matching um, panty sets, and I have a black and white one from Victoria's Secret, so that will match that one perfectly. So I love finding these, and I love finding them on sale. This, like, the quality feels like Victoria's Secret. The last clothing things are just all from Forever 21. I have one missing from the bunch because I did wear it already. I will try to include a picture of that. It is the prettiest maroonish romper and it's so, so, so simple. But I can wear it so many different ways. Definitely loved that romper. I love just finding affordable pieces for clothing. Um, because I feel like style comes and goes. There's something that's always in and out and I don't want to spend a lot of money on it. And if I do spend a, quite a bit of money, I want it to be a staple that's timeless. That's Guy with her toy. I want it to be a staple that's timeless that you're not going to worry about it going out of style. So for the things that I feel like are a little bit more stylish, that are on trend, I like to get them like at affordable places like Forever 21, H&M, Charlotte Roos, those type of places because I don't want to spend a lot of money on them. This dress is gorgeous. Like I wish I, you guys could see it, but it's like so dark in here. Um, it has that like lace up part right here and then it has these really pretty tassels and it is all lace and it's so freaking beautiful like um i just i cannot wait to wear this on a date night out with my husband he loves it when i dress up and i can picture him in his black suit to match me i love it when he dresses up in a suit so this is like a very perfect dressy going out to dinner like going out with friends type of outfit this was a little pricier for forever 21 but honestly it felt like something so luxurious that i was willing to pay that and when i put it on i instantly knew i was getting it um it's 27 dollars it's just so pretty you guys i'm gonna try and list all of the things i got in the bottom bar but if i don't don't kill me don't like give me like mean comments sometimes People are like, I thought you were gonna put it in the bottom bar, or why didn't you put it in the bottom bar? I will try. So the next thing I got is a maroon like shirt dress almost, and it is that suede material. Um, it's obviously faux suede because it's Forever 21, but it feels like pajamas, you guys. When I put it on, it's just so basic, but you can wear it so many ways, which I like to do with a lot of my outfits because I can wear them and wear them and wear them and wear them so many different ways, which is why I like to get basic sometimes because they're never gonna go out of style and no matter how many times you wear it, you can always make it look different. So with this, it's just a like longer dress. It comes to about my knees and it was how much? $14 and it just feels so comfortable. It's a little bit looser, which I like um, for the fall time. I can wear some booties with it. I can dress it up with some heels. I can wear a cute hat. There's just so many different things that you can do with these type of things. Um, I can't wait to show it to you guys in a video. Okay, so the last thing that I have is this super cute off the shoulder romper from Forever 21 as well. Um, it just looks like this. I will try to insert pictures as well and it has these bell sleeves which looks so freaking boho. It's so cute. I can't stand it. It just looks super cute and it's off the shoulder just like this. I can already picture it with like a black floppy hat and maybe some black booties or black lace up sandals um i just think this would be super cute for fall like i'm so excited to wear this i want to wash it first because it is a little big um but i like to get my rompers a little bit bigger because they always seem to shrink from forever 21 so i like to get them a size up and then when i wash them a couple times they shrink and they fit me perfectly you know so the last few items that i did get are from kylie cosmetics 
I know I said that I wasn't going to really purchase anything more from Kylie, but she had the free shipping and her shipping is kind of crazy when you spend like quite a bit of money on all of her other products and then you got to pay $9 for shipping. It's just, I don't like it. I, I just don't like it. So she finally offered free shipping and I jumped on it because I love Kylie's glosses and lip liners. They are so bomb. So, so, so good. I really like them a lot. So I purchased Candy K and that's what I'm wearing today. Oh my gosh, you guys. Candy K is beating literally for me in the lip gloss. Literally, you know how I told you guys, um, literally lip gloss was my good everyday go-to no matter what color, no. I think this one is, and I just put it on today because I just got it yesterday, but it is the perfect color, like the perfect nudie pinky color. I just, I'm obsessed. I love her glosses. I love the formula. I love that they're long lasting. I love the, the scent. It's just her colors are on point for nudes. She does do a good job with her nudes. And then I also picked up the Coco K and I swatched it. I originally picked this up for my sister. Um, because her birthday is in December and I like to shop early for people. Um, so I was like, oh, I'll pick it up for my sister, but I don't think I'm going to give this to my sister. I think I'm going to have to buy her another one um, because she's a little bit, she has dirty blonde hair. Um, so, and she has tan skin. She has the prettiest tan skin and green hazily eyes and I just think that Coco K would fit her so perfectly. She got so excited when she seen me wearing the Kylie lip gloss the other day and I was like, you know what, I think I'm gonna buy her one for her birthday, you know, add it to her birthday gift with something else. So I picked it up and I was like, it's gonna be way too light for me. It's just gonna be just ridiculously pale. I'm just gonna give it to her because she, it will go perfectly with her skin tone, you know? But when I swatched it, I was like, Oh my gosh, I'm not giving this to her. I'm keeping this. Um, I'm gonna buy her another one. I'm gonna buy one for my kid. It's just a good color. Like Kylie, you're on point. Also, I'm doing a photo shoot this weekend for me and my husband. So I did my makeup super dramatic. When you're taking your photos, you wanna go more dramatic than you normally would. And this is super dramatic for me. So I'm digging it. I like it on camera. I like it on photos, um, um, in person. It's a lot during the day for me but I do like it, so let me know what you guys think. I wanted it to be timeless because I wanna hang up canvases on my wall and I don't want my kids to later on be like, mom, you were a makeup artist, what were you doing? That was so weird, like why did you do that trend? So I just wanted something that was kind of timeless and I feel like this is it. It's not anything too dramatic where it's like over the top and it's just like too trendy. Um, I just feel like this is a timeless look, so if you guys like it let me know because I will definitely do that and I'm thinking of doing a video for you guys of my makeup and how I would get ready for an actual day to go take pictures and stuff. So that's pretty much it for my haul. I did get quite a bit of stuff which is not like me so I did want to film it for you guys and show you guys you know what I got and it is recent so you guys can go out and get it if you are interested or like any of these things. So yeah, I hope you guys like it and if you want to see a vlog from me, I did vlog when we went to Orlando this weekend. We went to Discovery Cove and we swam with the stingrays and stuff like that. We did do the dolphin experience because we did do that already before. It's such a fun experience if you've never done it. So if you guys want to see that vlog, um, please give it a thumbs up so that way I know you guys want to see more videos and want to definitely see that vlog. So I hope you guys enjoy your weekend and take care. Bye.